The Australian market has opened negatively this morning, despite overseas bourses having a resoundingly positive session in overnight trade. The Dow Jones rallied 178 points as domestic growth in the US overshadowed problems in Europe. While the US Fed Reserve left rates on hold and announced no new measures to stimulate the US economy, it did say it was willing to take further action if the economy failed to accelerate. After an hour of trade this morning, the ASX 200 has moved into negative territory, currently 16 points lower. In corporate news today, ANZ Bank has posted a 19% rise in full year net profit to $5.36 billion. It's a record for the bank. CEO Mike Smith warned markets are likely to remain volatile over the next two years after the global economic situation caused earnings in the bank's markets division to tumble over the last six months. ANZ is lower today, down 2.1% at $20.46. In disappointing news for News Corp, the company today announced a fall of 5% in first quarter profits. The company attributed the decline to one-off charges, but experienced an increase in revenues. Net profit fell 5% year-on-year to US $738 million for the three months to September 30. News Corp has lifted strongly today, up 2.5% at $16.93. The Aussie dollar was lower against the greenback this morning after the US Fed failed to announce any US economic stimulus measures, but is currently buying 102.5 US cents. This is John Bowers for Baker Young Stockbrokers.